This video will demonstrate the pigeonhole principle. The pigeonhole principle is a simple yet beautiful and useful idea. This was a principle by Dariclet, Peter Gustav Legion Dariclet, under the name in his native language called Scofec Principle, that is drawer principle or shelf principle. Let's take a real life example. Suppose that there are 10 pigeons and there are 9 pigeon holes. In the evening, each pigeon will pick one of the pigeon holes to stay. What will happen? When possible scenario is that one of the pigeon holes has two pigeons. We may also find all of the pigeons stay in one pigeon hole. There are many other solutions. But in any situation, we can conclude in one of the pigeon holes there will be at least two pigeons. More generally, we can say that if there are k pigeon holes and k plus 1 or more pigeons, then according to pigeon hole principle theorem 1, we conclude if there are k plus 1 or more objects are placed into k boxes or pigeon holes, the objects are termed as pigeons or items, then there is at least one pigeon hole or a box containing two or more of the objects or pigeons. This is theorem 1. This is applicable only when you are having items which are just above k plus 1 value or k value. For example, in a group of 367 people, there must be two people with the same birthday. Why this is? Because for a leap year, we are having 366 day. Normal year, we are having 365 days. So, if there are only 366 days in your whole year, so if you are having group of 367 people, one must be sharing his birthday with another. In a group of 27 English words, at least two words must start with the same letter. Why? Because there is only 26 letters in your English words. So, if you are talking about 27 English words, one must be something which is common to all the previous 26 letters. Now here, 27 English words are my pigeons or items, k plus 1 value and 26 letters is the pigeon hole, actual possible value for my given data. This is a pigeon hole principle where you are having k pigeon hole or boxes or container and k plus 1 pigeons or items or objects. So you can term that at least two boxes will share the same pigeons means there is k plus 1 by k pigeons sharing pigeon now what if our k plus 1 value is very bigger what if our this value is very bigger so in that case we go for generalized pigeon hole principle that is theorem 2 in that if you are having m pigeon holes or boxes or containers and there is n pigeons or items or objects then there must be at least m by n pigeons sharing pigeon hole print pigeon holes so the theorem is if m items or pigeons or objects are placed into n boxes and if m is greater than n then there is at least one box or container containing m by n items for example among 100 people now here 100 people are my pigeons there are at least how many peoples were born on the same month now here the month is my pigeon hole all the possibilities the possibility for my solution now there are only 12 months in a year so there must be 100 by 12 people who are sharing their birthday in the same month means there are 100 by 12 which is equal to 9 means at least 9 people among the 100 people who are having their birth month as the same month next example how many students in a class must there be to ensure that six students get the same grades and total possible grades are a b c d and f means there are five grades we have to calculate how many pigeons are there in a pigeon hole principle so we have to find what is the value of m and uh, we have given that there is uh, the result m by n is coming out to be 6 your value of n boxes is given that is m by 5 is equal to 6 so there must be at least 
we can conclude that there must be at least 26 lowest possible value like 6 5 is a 30 so we just have to perform 5 5 is a 25 plus 1 the k plus 1 then that will be your lowest value so the lowest possible value for n is my 26 if we will just try to distribute these people in the sixth grades or we can say that uh, these are the similar like first i have uh, placed five people in this grade again this this will ensure that at least two people are sharing the same grades at least three people sharing the same grades this is at least four people five and six now we just want only one count key where we are having the people who are sharing the same grades next example let s is a set which is having element going from 1 to 20 how many numbers to pick we are guaranteed that sum of two picture number is 21 so our pigeon hole will be all the possible number or the set of two number whose summing is coming out to be 21 all the possibilities will be 120 set of 1 and 20 219 318 417 516 615 and so on so these are the elements where their individual uh, elements sum is 21 so this is giving me sum as 21 this is also giving me sum as 21 and so on so there are total there are 10 pigeon holes in our uh, example like we will have 10 pigeon holes now in the worst case what we will have only one element from each of these boxes we don't want that our element should be having two elements should have sum of 21 so we are just picking only one one element from each of these different boxes so 10 number will be picked and when you will try to pick any of this number on the next round when you will just pick any of the number it will try to form the sum of uh, 21 with uh, any of one of the previous element so it will guarantee me guaranteedly give me that uh, that sum of the two pick number is always 21 so the count of number is 11 we can also use this pigeonhole principle when we are having number of pigeonhole is there number of pigeons is there and we just have to find at least one pigeonhole with how many pigeons are there so this example of generalized prison hole principle which is used for the proof is if k n plus 1 objects are placed in n boxes then some boxes contains at least k plus 1 object for example how we will solve this show that in a group of 15 people at least three were born on the same day of the week now we have to prove first of all we will find what are the pigeons what is the pigeon hole so pigeon is 15 people is my pigeon now three were born on the same day of the week now the day of the week is my pigeon hole now total days of the week are seven so there are seven pigeon holes or we can say seven boxes are there so value of n is my seven according to this definition previous theorem so there are 15 people so 15 people we are giving me will give me k n plus 1 value so if we will put the value of n we will get 50 is equal to k into 7 plus 1 so again we get that 14 is equal to 1 will be subtracted over here and we will get 14 is equal to k into 7 so we will get that k is equal to 2 now from this theorem we will uh, show that there are at least k plus 1 pigeons value of k is 2 so 2 plus 1 pigeons share a box or same box now here pigeons are people and the box is my birthday so means there are three people were born in the same day of the week